Hello there! In this video, we're going to talk about melodic contour. So let's kind of break that down a little bit. Now, the melody is kind of the main part of the music, and that's what we automatically listen to. And melody is made up of pitches and rhythm. Now, rhythm is the flow of music through time, and pitches are how high or low the sound is. Melodic contour, melody, melodic, and contour is the direction. And so now, the melody can go up, the melody can go down, or the melody can stay the same. So for instance, if we look at this image right here, which way do you see that the melody is going? Exactly, the melody is going up. Let's look at another one. Let's look at this one right here. Which way do you see that the melody is going? Correct again, it's going down. And let's look at this one right here. Notice how the melody is going both up and down. So now in music, there's not one right way to do it. Now the thing about music, is to keep it interesting, is our melody needs to be kind of going up and down. If we keep the melody the exact same the entire time, it can be rather boring. So let's listen to this example together of what it might sound like if the melody is this exact same. So our rhythm is going to change, but the pitch is not. So let's go ahead and listen to that right now. Yeah, it does kind of have a lot of zhuzh to it, you know? It's just kind of rather boring. Now, let's listen to a melody that has where the pitches are kind of jumping all over the place. Let's listen to that together. Wow. Those aren't wrong, but for me personally, and maybe for you, those just aren't extremely pleasing to the ear. So let's listen to one where the melody is taking steps up and steps down to see how that feels and that sounds. Let's listen to that together. Now for me, that sounds a little bit nicer than, than the first two. And again, music is subjective, so there's not one right way. Um, but again, for me, maybe for you, the third one that we listened to was a little bit more pleasing to the ears. And that's just because our melodic contour had structure to it. It wasn't random, and it wasn't the same thing repeating itself over and over. And so when you're creating music, keep in mind how your melody is moving. Now, there are leaps and there are steps. And so a leap is just where your pitch or where your note is just going to jump to another one. And there are steps where it's just going to touch the neighbor, move up to the neighbor, or move down to the neighbor next to it. So that's melodic contour. And when you're listening to music, listen for that. Listen for the melody and how it's moving. Is it going up, staying the same, or down? And again, there's not one right way to do it. There are just different options. And you need to make music, you need to listen to music that's pleasing to your ears. Thank you so much. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.